All right, I'm out here today. We just finished backfilling and doing final grade. Uh, we're scheduled to start framing here tomorrow. And I just want to take you guys over here, to talk a little bit about water management and when you're grading a house before you start framing, what you can do to help it. Uh, we've got pretty severe expansive soils here, which is why on this home we did a, a pretty state-of-the-art progressive uh, foundation system called Telefirma. If you don't uh, know what that is yet, check out the other videos for the Erie build. Um, but in any event, we're past that point. Just finished backfilling, like I said, and we did a positive grade. And what that means is with water management, I've got expansive soils that can, when they get wet can swell pretty severely. And we want to keep as much water away from the foundation because of that in any situation, but especially here. Um, when we have these expansive soils, we can turn into a sponge or act like a sponge once it gets wet and then dries out. So we built up our foundation a little bit higher, created a, a little bit higher elevation to um, allow us to get this final grade, um, what we call positive slope. Um, code allows or requires six inches for every 10 feet of slope away from the home. We've got more than that here. Um, that equals about a 10% grade. We're probably looking at more like a 15% grade here. So if you can look back here, I'll take you on around, walk you down here. If you can look behind me, I'm actually walking down the hill. And right over there, as we go back out here, from the top of our foundation down to grade is a little over 13 inches. And from there, we're gonna slope that down and away from the house all the way around it. You can look here at that same grade. And what that's gonna help us do is take that water, anything that snow, rain, whatever it is, even sometimes landscaping, which I discourage all homeowners, do not plant foliage, landscaping, or anything like that that needs water within five feet of the house. Create other areas, drought resistant stuff, um, gray breeze, whatever it is, don't plant right against the house. You don't need water there. It's just not gonna, it's not conducive to trying to manage water and keep it out of the home um, for all kinds of reasons. And we talked about drain tile and perimeter drains before and there, there's a reason why. You know, now we're back to grade and moving that stuff away. So we've got that drain, that drain, drainage coming down and away from the house. Um, and in some places it's as severe on the back as about 14%, which is gonna keep any water from even trying to climb back down onto that foundation wall. Um, and that's why we, when we do our elevations before we even do excavation, we allow for this drainage um, to get us this, this positive water management system in this situation where we don't have to water, worry about it once the home is finished. Um, so there you are, we start framing tomorrow. Stay tuned and uh, I'll give you a shot when we uh, got the walls up.